up going out the window, and I landed on Toad's car. You guys made a real mess. Yeah. His car is still broken. Well, he should I really look into some insurance here. here. Wow. What? He just leaves everything the way it is. Oh, do we have to like investigate now? All right, son. All right, he's gone. He's left. It's over now. That was a guy. Uh. Is that his son? Toads, I think. Be nice in there, okay? Oh God, I have to be nice, nice. I'm gonna go in, catch him by surprise. <laughs> Big B and Miss White. Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. He's looking awfully shady. Sorry, Big B. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. Sorry for dragging Miss White into this. We heard someone crying. Oh, the boy stubbed his toe on the bed frame is all. It stings, you know, but it's nothing to kick up a fuss about. A little tub swim, he'll be right as rain, I'm sure. So you just gotta keep in denial. Is your son in there? Oh, he's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna... So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I yeah, mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. Someone was here, and something's going on. Just so this trip wasn't a complete waste of time, I'm gonna look around a bit before we leave, okay? The longer you talk, the longer this takes, so just stand over there and shut all up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. I have a seat. I have a cup of tea, whatever you like. TJ, are you all right? There you are. Oh, I don't mean so to cute. intrude, but Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection, and I was wondering if you could perhaps let me see it? It has a weevil. Cool. A weevil. Whoa. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. Smash lamp. Check that out. Now this happened. Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh-huh. The lamp just fell off the table. Well, the boy was faffing about, playing salts and sold fish. Who knows with the lad? What? Okay. So I just check everything. The stain. Bleeding. Why? Is that it's blood? Still fresh. Oh well, I cut me end. <laughs> Ran around like a tit trying to pick out a wrap. Must have got some on the furnishments. Lamp in pieces, blood on the wall. It's awful, I know. Sounds painful. Oi! Don't you go mavering now. The wound didn't sit very long, you know. Hooks have been a fable, I suppose. <laughs> and a frog. <laughs> Alright, it's over there. The window. Open it. I was trying to get out. I see. I what is see. it now? If it's blood, you know what happened. No. I there's marks here on the window, sir. And what's that about? No real reason. Just last night when I'd come out, I was in a, a downright dizzy, mate, as you would be. And <laughs> I plum forgot the keys to this place. And I had to climb in through the bloody window. Really? Mm. 
scared Junior off to death. What else is there? A fireplace poker. I want to jab him with it. If he doesn't tell me anything, it looks like he was already jabbed with it. Never mind. And what happened here? The poker? What of it? There's more blood on the tip. This happened before or after you came in the window. After, after. Oh, I was, I was poking the coals and it slipped a bit. Sliced up in my foot like a seashell. Looked like a shit ugly thing. If you're gonna mm. say something, out with it. You cut yourself, but didn't put the poker away after? Uh -huh. I'm sorry, me housekeeping's not up to your standards. Worked out of it. Oh, we have him with it. Oh my god, will you not make a big faff out of this? There's nothing to solve here, Sheriff. I'm telling you everything that happened. Why don't you believe me? I mean, things happen, you know. I think maybe you're hiding something. Hiding something? Maybe. But, uh, to tell you the truth, I don't know yet. I know you're lying about yeah. something, but I'm not. And you're just gonna make it worse for yourself the longer you keep up the act. I'm not bullshitting you, honest. We'll see. Let's drop it on the ground. Can I hit him? Making me really mad, Toad. Well, there's like nothing, nothing else. Aha, uh -huh. a dust ring. That more blood? No, just a clean space in the dust. Did you move something? Ah, uh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, who knows? It was the lamp. Okay, Sheriff, now what? That broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Um, Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? Because it wasn't on, on that table, Toad. There isn't any room in the electric outlets. Huh? What are it you... It was plugged in over here, and now it's there. Uh, I did some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Did not plug it in. Come on, Toad. I just hadn't gotten around to it yet. You see how many damn plugs there are. Okay, well, I'm I'm done. Are you kidding me? You're just in complete denial. I'll talk to him, maybe. You see. I think my junior has a crush on your girl. Get tough, Toad. I know you're lying about the lamp. The lamp fell, is all. I bumped it, coming, coming in from the the, the thing. The lamp could not possibly have fallen. You Toad. could have to throw you him so in over it. here the whole time. Are you kidding Someone me? Ripped the lamp out Tell of the me wall the truth. Through the thing. The truth. That's what happened, isn't it? It's gonna make me hit him. Don't oomph me. Look. You want me out of here, I want out of here. Just come clean. What's going on? The place needs a little brooming, that's all. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done, let's go. Stupid. Stupid frog. Though most people think they are. Uh-huh. How's it going? Toad's hiding something, but I don't know what yet. Did the kid say anything? No, but I'm worried. He has two huge bruises on his arms. He won't tell me why, and he acted nervous when I brought it up. Hmm. Something's going on. Stay with the kid until I figure out why. What are you kidding me? I don't want to do more investigations. Investigations. What is it? Get tough. I know something's off here, Toad. And I know you know I can't leave until I find out why. So can we please just skip to the end of the page before I have to get mean? I don't know what you want, Big B. There's nothing going on. 
intimidate there's him. Just, there's just nothing to tell. Look around the room and see for yourself. Everything has its explanation, you'll see. Honestly, Toad, I don't know if I will. And I don't know if I've got the patience to reverse engineer whatever scheme this is. Me boy's in the other room, Big B. Come on now. We're friends, right? I'm gonna hit him next time. Yeah. I was right, I scared him. He busted latch. Oh, I didn't Why see that. Why is the lock busted? Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. A spot of dust and a broken lock. What are you getting at, mate? Oh, for Christ's sake, a fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like everything else in this bloody building. <sighs> bloody <sighs> big, big. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running. Didn't stop the recycling. What's the point of all this, mate? Really? Why haven't you fixed this? Anyone on the street could just walk right in. There's better priorities than busted door knobs. And who's gonna come in and take anything? There's nothing to take. Big B, come on, oh, yeah, I'm begging sure. for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... the sniffing around at me private belongings. I'm sorry I call, really I am. But will you please, please just bugger off? Not yet. Not yet, you say, to my face. And you think I'm hiding <sighs> something from you? Well, you've had the go of the room for a fair bit of time now. Nothing's here. So when? When are you gonna leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. It's not seemely. When? I want him to tell me told. stuff. Well, I've told you the I'm truth, sick of mate. this. Jesus Christ, what more do you want? Oh, <laughs> God. You oh. lied. These stories have made no sense. You didn't forget your keys. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. Progress? I caught his lies. Ooh, there we go. Mr. Right Toad, there. you're bleeding. Take off the hat. Ugh. It was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, Dame D. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. And if you had come in when I asked you to, maybe he wouldn't have the nerve to strong arm me boy. He hurt Toe Jr. How awful. What the hell does he care? It's always the same with you, isn't it, Big B? If I'm in trouble, need help, if I call about something, you always take live long day to get here. What if he done something worse, eh? I'm tired of feeling trivial, mate. A lot Ooh. of us are. We're sorry, oh, come on, today. Michael. Really. We were lucky it didn't go any further. What, what did, did you, you tell him? him? Well, I was like in nothing sync. Nothing he wanted to know, except if I had this well. thing that he wanted. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. Oh, that's horrible. He tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. <laughs> uh, sometimes. Borrows? I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. I merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. <laughs> Fine bit of dress it is. We have to go get the stuff. What? He keeps it in... Keeps it in the chimney? <gasps> oh, that's the donkey no, skin that, thing. Sorry. There we go. So that was her in the uh, in the book. Wait. Mysterious object. It's an envelope. Fucking hell! Of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. What do you want to do with it? Um. Don't make it a dilemma. She's dead. 
or something. Um, Just open it. Okay, I'll open it. Uh, what's in there? I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I thought he was for? dead, though. I Ooh. don't know. Oh, come on, really? Maybe Lawrence does. Really? I thought well, he was dead. Well, it's been dead. quite a surprising oh, day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out. Great. I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. <laughs> and don't worry about what happened earlier. Just feel better, okay? And if you're looking for the woodsman, try down at the trip trap. Oh my gosh. Really?